finally have damage. See, I'm not gonna actually go through with that, but... die? I think so, because these are starting out to become really good dies. I do need healing, and a hollow flash die is really good. Yeah! Fuck yeah! Finally! Just the guy I've been looking for. I think it's guaranteed at this point? Yes. Check it out, dude. Show very rare dice to the collector. Oh my, I've never seen anything like this. Look at those strange colors. Here, here, grab what you want. It's not bad. Choose one relic. Okay, Bullseye is literally the worst one in the entire game. It sucks. Joker's okay, though. Oh, is this actually an empty one? No way. This is so easy. I already know it's gonna blow up. Moon Chakram. I almost think I have to go with this one. Just because it's the safest bet. I actually get to choose what I want. Again, that's pretty good. So I'm I've made it to floor 50. Do I get the trophy or do I have to Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, baby, that's what I've been waiting for. So I do that. The makeshift trench is the makeshift trench in Nightmare Plasma makes it so you get it basically no matter what. Because everything I have just goes up. And he can't do damage to me. He'll never do more than like 5 damage and I'll always have 6 shield. So we'll just watch these numbers grow. Alright, let's get this rolling. Okay, let's see if I get the trophy. If I don't, this is gonna be horrible. Yeah, that's a lot of damage! Inflict 100. In the end, this game is free. The fact that I got any time out of this game is fantastic. I originally only wanted to play this for the trophies, but I kept playing because of how thrilling the gameplay was. Nobody ever believes that games such as Yahtzee or Monopoly are games of skill, but they are. This game is like Yahtzee on Fent right after snorting a line off Ronald McDonald's shoe in a swimming pool full of mayonnaise on Christmas morning. No, I will not be explaining what I mean by that.